Hi, it's Kara Tharkney Farms, and today is January 26th. Um, the heifers are eating some hay. Their other hay is over in the building. Um, I'm not sure if we've showed you that or not. Yeah, let's just check on the animals. The one heifer showed signs of heat the other day, so that means that she wasn't accidentally caught by Ben before we got them moved. If you guys keep up with my other videos, we were worried about that at one point when we separated them. They're not being overly nice to Hershey right now. She's definitely low lady on the totem pole, and they're really starting to get their horns. <laughs> Ben has been watching the gate a lot because the one showed a lot of signs of heat. We never got the girls preg checked because things just didn't line up, right? I don't know exactly when they're going to calf. And because Tinkerbell didn't raise her bull calf that she had last year, she probably cycled around really fast and was rebred. I feel like... She's probably going to be our first cow to calve this year. And we'll see how that goes. So this is where we're feeding the heifers hay. So I'm going to have to push this rest of this bale down. And it'll be time to put a new bale in soon. I don't really have much to say about the pigs. But they're here. Things will be moving around again soon because we might have something else coming to the farm soon. So, horns, still with her ring of shame. She's probably gonna wear that for the rest of her time. And Benjamin Bull here. Benjamin! Say hi. And then Miss Jersey Girl here and Miss Tinkerbell. Tinkerbell, you're looking mighty wide. They have another bale in the wean too. Over there. So, but this one is their preferred eating place right now. Tinkerbell! Hi, pretty lady! Hi, Horns. You're such a pretty girl, too. I hope you don't have twins in there again this year. She is looking a bit skinny, but I can also see that her... She's definitely rounded with calves still. Um, we'll be getting them some more higher quality hay bales again soon. January's always hard on the cows and this year I feel like it's been harder on them because of the up and down in weather. One day it's, well, as you can see right now it's snowing, um, but some days it's snowing, some days it's raining, some days it's freezing rain. So... And we just have a constant circle of not great weather. <laughs> Horns had dried up as the heifers are obviously weaned. Um, and now it looks like she's starting to redevelop an udder. So if I can get down, I will try to see what we can see. But I still say we have a ways to go. She's definitely got another that looks like it could start feeding the calf again. But Ben's also right on her tail. <laughs> ben, you did your job long ago. They're probably done till summer again. Ben. 
Here's your big boy. He's such a good boy. Lauren, do you want me to give you a little pet too? I don't want to touch the electric wire. I don't have anything. We just got some new animals. We have picked up two Nigerian dwarf goats. Let's go see them. So this is what I've got going on for them right now. Things might change, but as of right now, we've got this building for a little while. Say hello to Fern and Fiona. So this is Fiona and Fern, that's the names they came with. One of them is due on the 6th of March, and the other one is due on the 25th of March. So we'll keep you updated. They're super nervous right now. I hope they start eating some hay and getting some water. Duke is not impressed. <laughs>